guys, welcome back to my channel. You may be thinking, Beth, the last time you did one of these videos you were wearing the exact same thing and your hairstyle was the exact same. I am filming it on the same day. That is why I'm looking the exact same. Do not fear, I do wash, I do have other clothes, I do have hygiene. <laughs> anyway, the last episode of this series we went through my 2009 diary. This time we're moving on to something no one has ever seen, not even in my vlogs, and that is 2010, which I believe starts in here. It does indeed. It starts in this one, 2010. So, I haven't even read through this in a long time, so I have no idea what to expect. Should we just flick to a random page? Here we go. Okay, this is an interesting one. The 3rd of February 2010, it was a Wednesday. Today was really fun, I got lots of homework though. I suppose it didn't take too long. I hope I don't get any more tomorrow. And then, then it's like a separate paragraph and I put, I think I need to get more thinner by doing more exercises, but I can never be bothered, lol. So I would have been 12 when I wrote this, nearly 13, and I was worrying about my weight then. Isn't that crazy? Like, I shouldn't be worrying about things like that when I'm 13. Fun fact for you, on the 8th of February 2010, it snowed, but just not a lot. That's crazy, oh my goodness. The 9th of February 2010 was a Tuesday. Today was focus day, but it was actually really, really fun. We had to design a prom catering with four roles. The boss, the food person, the money person, and the designer person. I was the designer person. We had to perform our presentation to the whole class. Our name was Sunnyside Catering and I came second. The winners had to perform to the year. Oh, thank God I didn't win then. <laughs> I'd have hated that. But how crazy. I didn't realise myself that I wanted to do any kind of design until I got to college. And that was more photography I wanted to do. Graphic design was my last choice. And then it was a last sort of minute thing when I started to really enjoy graphic design that I decided to do it at uni so it's crazy that I preferred all the designy stuff when I was like 12 and 13 as well and I just didn't really know that like I didn't really notice oh 12 year old me going to the dentist I have the this was on the 16th of February I have the dentist tomorrow I hope none of my teeth have to be pulled out I'm really worried and mum won't be there sad crying face I still I, oh, I still hate going to the dentist now, but back then um, I had really bad teeth and I had to get teeth pulled out quite a lot because my baby teeth wouldn't fall out by themselves very well. So yeah, I always used to be petrified going to the dentist. I still don't like it now, but thankfully now, normally everything's all good. <laughs> oh, this was so much fun. This is the one and only time I've ever gone donutting and it was on the 18th of February in 2010. Today was great. I went donutting with, oh, I'm gonna say the person is Millie. I went donutting with Millie and her party people. It was really fun and her party people, that sounds funny. Then I went out with my parents in the evening and who did I call this person? Cody, this was Cody. <laughs> then I went to the then I went out in the evening with my parents and Cody was there. I really, really like him. I can never ever think of anything to talk about or do. We just get bored. Wow, I was great then, wasn't I? Come on, up your flirt in game, 12 year old me. <laughs> then at the bottom I put, that makes me sad, but I'll see him tomorrow anyway. <laughs> That's so cute. A little romance is when I was like 12. <laughs> oh, 12 year old me, what were you doing? Right, do I really want to read this to you? <laughs> it's so embarrassing. Okay, Saturday the 20th of February. Today was all right, I was at home all day, but I was texting Cody and he asked me if I still fancied him. So obviously I told him I fancy him, that is not the way you play it, you gotta play it cool, come on now. And I said, maybe, lol, why? <laughs> and he just put, just wondering, but I hope he likes me. I mean, I know he likes me as a friend, but as more than a friend, it would be so awesome if he asked me out. <laughs> oh, that's so cringy. Oh, I had a proper little crush on this guy though, I really did. 
you guys have ever been through a little crush or still going through a crush from school or something, give me some support by liking this video and letting me know that I'm not alone in this. And if I am alone in this, then I'm very sorry that you have to go through this with me because it was very cringy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me read you this little bit from the Tuesday. Tuesday the 2nd of March. Today was okay. I mean, it was great. Only in school for 15 minutes because it was pupil review day. So pupil review day, you literally went in for 15 minutes to see your tutor. I don't know if you guys will have that as well, but I loved them. I was like, yeah. <laughs> I was on Club Penguin most of the time, but I'm getting the new JLS book with this massive grinning smiley face. I used to love Club Penguin. Every time I came home from school, I'd go on it. Obviously, after I'd done my homework, I was a good girl. And then at the bottom, I put, I really want to see JLS in concert. And then you turn the page. <laughs> the 3rd of March. Today was great. School was okay, but dot, dot, dot. I'm going to see JLS in December. I wrote it in like such big letters. That's so funny. Don't know if you can see that. Mm. And then I put whoop whoop, I can't wait. And then the next day I put, I actually can't believe it's already Thursday. I still can't believe I'm going to see JLS. Ah. <laughs> I really want to, I really want to go to a JLS CD signing. Well, that never happened. But yeah, obviously I was very, very, very excited to go and see JLS. Right, let's go for a last one. I'm gonna leave you guys with the week that I had at Cow Shop because I am interested to read it actually. I've just seen the first page, so I hope the rest of the days are okay. Monday the 4th, 24th of May. Today I went to Cow Shop. I'm sharing a room with Bill and Ben. I'm just gonna say Bill and Ben, even though they were girls, but Bill and Ben. <laughs> when I got there, we had lunch. Then I had two activities. I had inst Institive. Mm, not sure if I spelt that right because I have no idea what that is. Something course and rock climbing. I got to the top of the rock wall. Okay, I'm pretty impressed with that. I don't remember this. What? <laughs> Did I really? Moving on to Tuesday. The first night at Cow Shop was quite fun. I really like. Oh, what can I call this person? Joe. Let's call him Joe. I really like Joe. I did the velodrome today, it was awesome. I remember doing the velodrome, you know, like the big circular thing they have in the Olympics with the bikes go on. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> Wednesday, at Calshot, I did orienteering today. It was quite good and funny because Lily, let's just call her Lily, had to pee in a bush, lol. <laughs> oh, I'm lovely, aren't I? Um, Joe is so cute, with a smiley face. Thursday, today I did a pod cross. I got wet. Clearly it was raining. What's a pod cross? I don't know. We made a bridge. Oh, I had to make a bridge to get over the, I remember. We made a bridge and then a raft and the raft sank and I got pushed in the pool, lol. Oh, that says pool cross. Looks like pod. Okay, I did a pool cross and I got pushed in the pool. Yeah, I remember that. I also did trawling today. I got to steer the boat. Oh yes, lol. I don't remember doing that. Sounds quite fun. <laughs> Joe said if I fell off the boat, he would jump in to save me, smiley face. Oh, I was so cute. My little crushes. <laughs> Friday, last day at Cow Shot. I will miss the chocolate machines. Oh, they did the best hot chocolate machines. Oh, they're amazing. Today I did stream mapping. It was okay-ish, lol. I saw my mum, yay. I stayed at my friends just gonna say my friends because we're leaving it there and then on saturday i was like finally my own bed i'd obviously missed my bed so much oh i remember that so much that was a little insight into my world again very cringe my crushes changed quite a lot as you can probably tell but i really hope you are enjoying this series if you are please give it a thumbs up to let me know that you want to see more we are going to be getting closer and closer to the present day. So if you want to see that, then just give it a thumbs up and let me know. And subscribe down below if you want to see it too. And I will see you guys next week with another video. Bye! Zoella's books. If you haven't read them, you are seriously missing out. Like, 